Hello and welcome to Select 10. There isn't anything that compares to the adrenaline rush of an action film filled with intense combat scenes, lengthy pursuit sequences, and dramatic shootouts. We made a number of the best action films videos, and those films aren't included here, because we always try to recommend films that you might not have seen, rather than ones you've already seen. But in order to make the list interesting to everyone, we've chosen a few well-known and a few underappreciated action films that you should watch if you haven't already. Now let's start the video. Number 10. Skyscraper. It is a 2018 action thriller film, directed by Ross and Marshall Thurber. The plot revolves around Will Soy, an ex-FBI agent and war hero, who now examine buildings' defenses. While on contract to review the Hong Kong skyscraper, constructed on the world's highest and strongest structure, things go wrong when the building is targeted by terrorists, trapping Will's wife Sarah and their two kids inside the erupting building. The plot continues as Will attempts to break into a building and climb into a blazing skyscraper that is 225 floors above ground level in order to save his family from harm and stop the terrorists. There is not much of a deep story to consider, but it works best when Johnson is in action mode. Even so, it falls short of what we've seen in films like Fast and Furious or Black Adam. Nevertheless, there are enough fascinating and thrilling instances, a small amount of family drama, and a few excellent action moments in the story to please action movie fans. Number 9. Need for Speed. It is an action crime film directed by Scott Waugh. You must have heard of or played this game, but for those who haven't, this movie is an adaptation of the Electronic Arts Racing video game series of the same name. Truthfully, this film had franchise potential similar to the Fast and Furious movies, but tragically, it did not happen. However, those who enjoy watching car racing action need to see this. The plot centers on mechanic Toby Marshall, who specializes in muscle car racing on an underground racetrack while trying to keep his garage workable. To continue his profession, he unwillingly joins forces with the rich but cunning Dino Brewster, who traps Toby for an offense and imprisons him. Two years after that, Toby is fully prepared for vengeance, but the only way he can defeat Dino is to win a competitive race. But in order to arrive on time, he needs to skillfully avoid a group of law enforcement officers and bounty hunters. Along with action, this movie is also about romance, redemption, vengeance, and, most importantly, racing. What this movie is missing, though, is a strong rival. But the fantastic car chases and superb driving are the main elements that keep you captivated throughout the entire movie, and the stunts were genuinely awesome. Number 8. 71. It is an action thriller film, directed by Jan Demange. You have probably never heard of this one, and it's one of the most underrated on this list. The plot centers on a young trooper who, after a frightening conflict in Belfast in 1971, is unintentionally left behind by his squad. Unable to tell friend from enemy in the chaos that comes next, he is forced to spend the evening on his own and navigate a dangerous and confusing territory in order to reach shelter. The movie is intense, has a dark plot, and beautifully constructed fight sequences. It skillfully strikes the right balance in the narrative between being an engaging action story and demonstrating devotion for historical events. Number 7. Atomic Blonde. It is an action thriller film directed by David Leach. It's odd that this film didn't get a sequel, it's a crazy and chaotic action film that is a joy for fans of this genre. The story follows MI6's top spy, Lorraine Broughton, who employs all of her deadly abilities to survive a near-impossible operation. Her mission takes place as the Berlin Wall is ready to crumble, while she enters the center of the city to retrieve the names of vanished dual spies and uncover a secret surveillance group. She joins forces with a station head to take on the most treacherous game of spies in order to finish the task no matter what. In fact, the tale is quite strong, packed to the capacity with spectacular action, including a suspenseful 10-minute single-take combat scene that is vicious and stylish. Additionally, Charlize Theron is a fantastic action star, and also check out her Netflix film which is too good and has mind-blowing action. Number 6. Homefront. It is an action drama film, directed by Gary Fleeter. The plot centers on ex-officer, Phil Broker, who chooses to leave his terrible past behind and relocates to an apparently peaceful tiny community with his daughter. However, his peacekeeping idea goes horribly wrong when he learns that the area is overflowing with criminal activity and drugs. Meanwhile, a neighborhood drug boss places him and his little daughter in danger, causing Broker to resort to action once again to protect her in their house. 
The film contains some solid old-school action moments, an elegant style, and strong performances from the secondary characters. Jason Statham is entertaining in his part and delivers solid action, while everyone else goes crazy around him. Number 5. American Made. It is a crime action comedy film, directed by Doug Lyman. The narrative centers on pilot, Barry Seal, who is hired by the CIA to conduct surveillance on the threat that is developing in Central America. But ultimately, the Medellin cartel, which is linked to Pablo Escobar, noticed his work and looked for a worker with his expertise. However, Barry is put in control of one of the largest secret CIA programs, which not only offers him money-making opportunities, but also places him at grave risk. It is the terrifying true story of Barry Seal's life, an ex-CIA pilot who went on to join the Medellin cartel as a drug runner in the 1980s. When you watch the movie, a couple of your questions about whether or not he was caught and on whose side he actually was will be answered. The premise itself is intriguing, and the humor and satirical touch it adds to an already dramatic crime thriller are just incredible. Anyone who wants to see Tom Cruise in films other than the Mission Impossible series must watch this one. Number 4. Tomb Raider. It is a 2018 action-adventure film, directed by Roar Uthog. It is a reboot of the Tomb Raider film franchise and is based on a video game of the same name. The story centers on Lara Croft, who, in an effort to unravel the mystery behind her father's disappearance, sets out on a risky trek to the final location, a legendary tomb on a mythical island where he was believed to have been. Lara Croft is the child of an extraordinary, wealthy explorer who went missing many years ago. As her quest progresses, the risks rise, and Lara is compelled to go forward into the uncharted land, using her smart intellect, firm belief, and strong attitude. But the task grows more difficult, as just getting to the island becomes highly dangerous, leaving her with no choice but to challenge herself beyond her limits. The storyline is functional and paced unevenly, but the epic journey on the island, the hunting, and the action hold the audience's attention from the very first moment. Number 3. Eternals. It is a superhero action film, based on the Marvel Comics beings of the same name. It surprises me that so many fans didn't enjoy this one. Of course, it's not the greatest, and a lot of potential has been wasted. However, we cannot dispute the fact that it features some of the best new characters and opens the door to great future narratives. Although we may not be realizing it now, Eternals can become one of the most underappreciated superhero films in the future. The Eternals are a kind of ancient alien group and a fresh team of Marvel Cinematic Universe superheroes who have been quietly residing on Earth in stealth for hundreds of thousands of years. After the conclusion of Endgame, an unexpected event forced them to come together to fight humanity's ancient rival, the Deviants, who are determined to destroy the Earth. As the plot develops, it becomes increasingly clear why they want to destroy it and why the Eternals arrived on Earth in the first place. If you intend to watch an MCU films from the beginning, you can watch this movie now and connect the dots later because it has an independent plot. The Icarus and Makari characters were the best. Once the action started, they were awesome, especially Makari's speed abilities and the way they were demonstrated was unique and unlike any speedster power we have seen many times. The film contains spaceships, monster fights, and spectacular visuals, but it could have been better if there was more action and more intensity. Number 2. The Bad Guys, Reign of Chaos. It is a crime action drama, directed by Sun Young Ho. The story starts when a bus carrying the prisoners flips, allowing the criminals to flee. In the aftermath, the police assemble a specialized task force that must act quickly in order to control the resulting chaos and catch them up once again. The main story focuses on Park Woon Cheel, who joins the specialized task force to find the offenders and bring them back to custody. But when a criminal group intervenes and starts interfering, the situation becomes more difficult. The plot remains faithful to its genre and offers plenty of action, thrills, and excitement, thanks in large part to creative stunts. The characters are fascinating, and there are some hilarious situations that will have you laughing aloud. Despite the plot being very typical and having decent CGI, the film is worth seeing for action. Number 1. Black Adam. It is a 2022 superhero action film, directed by John Cole at Sarah. The action starts the moment you see Iraq and doesn't stop until the final credits roll. Yes, this film includes non-stop epic action sequences that will keep you on the edge of your seat. The story begins almost 5,000 years later, since Black Adam received the supreme abilities from the old gods, but for some reason, the gods locked him in his eternal grave. 
The craziness starts when an archaeologist looking for a historic crown accidentally discovers Black Adam's grave and awakens him without fully understanding who he is. After being set free, Black Adam goes out to wreak havoc and exact his own way of justice. However, a team of superheroes called the Justice Society makes an effort to stop him from destroying everything in his path, but can they? Additionally, the mystery surrounding the crown plays a significant role in this, adding to the action in the climax. The narrative was not quite strong enough, but we won't discuss what went wrong. As for this topic, we are rating this movie just for its ability to provide entertaining action, and if all you want is action, this one has plenty and won't let you down. That's it for today, thank you for watching this video. And do subscribe our channel to see more videos related to movies and series suggestions.